गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट दिस लतीफ सर दिस इज माई थर्ड वीडियो ऑन एल्कोहल फेनॉल एंड इथर्ड्स इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट इथर्ड्स इन द प्रीवियस टू वीडियो आई हैव डिस्कस्ड ऑलरेडी आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस अबाउट एल्कोहल एंड फेनॉल्स देयर प्रिपरेशन एंड देयर केमिकल्स रिएक्शन एंड हुई रिएक्शन यू हैव टू रीड आई हैव मार्क्ड इन द पी डी एफ यू कैन सी एंड आई एम मेकिंग ऑल दिस वीडियो ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ रेडियो सिलेबस ओनली ओके so ethers ethers are organic compounds in which two alkyl or aryl groups are attached to a divalent oxygen and ethers uh, are represented by the general formula r o r r o r this is the general formula of ether when r uh, r and r dash are alkyl groups it may be same type or different types okay for example सी एच थ्री ओ सी एच थ्री डाई मिथाइल इथर सी टू एच फाइव ओ सी टू एच फाइव डाई इथाइल इथर ओके एंड दिस द सिंपल इथर एंड मिक्सड इथर इफ द टू एल्किल ग्रुप आर डिफरेंट देन द इथर्स आर नोन एज मिक्सड इथर फॉर एग्जाम्पल सी एच थ्री ओ सी टू एच फाइव दिस इज नोन एज इथाइल मिथाइल इथर सी एच थ्री ओ सी थ्री एच सेवन मिथाइल एन प्रोपाइल इथर ओके सो एंड देर नोमेन क्लेचर अकॉर्डिंग टू आई पी सी सिसटेम आई पी सी आई पी सी अकॉर्डिंग टू आई पी सी सिसटेम इथर्स आर रिगार्डेड एज एलकॉक्सी एल्किन लाइक मिथक्सी मिथेन दिस एक्चुअली डाई मिथाइल इथर बट अकॉर्डिंग टू आई पी सी सिसटेम methoxy methane dimethyl ether is also called di methoxy methane according to ipsc nomenclature similar diethyl ether is also known as ethoxy ethane <coughs> and this ethyl methyl ether is also known as methoxy ethane methoxy methoxy uh, meth methyl group you have to write the name of methyl group first and then a larger group ethyl so methoxy and then methane this is according to ipsc nomenclature according to ipsc ethers are regarded as alkoxy alkene and first you have to write the name of a smaller alkyl group like methoxy and then bigger alkyl group as alkene okay now synthesis of ethers the main uh, synth uh, synthesis of al uh, of ether is williamson synthesis the method is williamson synthesis so by williamson synthesis reaction you can prepare ethers in this reaction primary alkyl halide like methyl iodide methyl bromide or ethyl bromide or propyl iodide like this primary alkyl halide reacts with sodium alkoxide that is sodium salt of alcohol like sodium methoxide ch3oona or sodium ethoxide ch3ch2oona so when alkyl halide primary alkyl halide reacts with sodium alkoxide sodium salt of alcohol you will get ether just remove ona just remove uh, remove nabr just remove nabr uh br from halogen br br from alkyl halide and sodium from sodium alkoxide okay just remove nabr and join them it will be converted into ether like ch3ch2o ch3 uh, ch2ch3 ch3 ch2o ch2ch3 this is ether another example This is a tertiary butyl alcohol alkoxide sodium salt of tertiary butyl sodium salt of tertiary bu uh, butanol when react with primary al uh, alkyl halide like CH3Br you have to remove NaBr and join them you have to remove NaBr and join them it will be converted into ether CH3O and tertiary butyl group one alkyl group this one and another alkyl group this is tertiary butyl group is also an example of ether okay so using williamson synthesis you can prepare ether 
from primary alkyl halide and sodium solop alcohol. Similarly, when sodium salt of uh, phenol, that is sodium uh, phenoxide reacts with Rx, you will get alkoxy benzene. This is also uh, William Seals, uh, Williamson synthesis. Okay, now physical properties of uh, physical properties of ethers. Ethers are polar uh, but insoluble in water and have low boiling point than alcohol of comparable molecular masses because ethers do not form hydrogen bond wa with water but alcohol can form uh, hydrogen bond with, uh, with water that's why alcohols are more soluble than ether. Ether uh, ethers are insoluble in water. Now structure of uh, ethers uh, given in ether the oxygen atom is sp3 hybridized tetrahedral structure the uh, shape is v-shape this is the shape of ether now chemical reaction of ether reaction with hx hydrogen halide when ethers like ror reacts with hx you will get alkyl halide rx and alcohol when ether reacts with uh, hydrogen halide that is hx that is uh, when ether reacts with hydrogen halide like hbr hcl hi you will get alkyl halide rx plus alcohol okay so similarly uh, this is see this example so uh, this ether when reacts with hi hx just break this bond and make phenol and rx okay this is actually sn2 reaction so when ether reacts with hydrogen halide you will get alkyl halide and alcohol and the order of reactivity of different hydrogen halide uh, is as follows hi greater than hbr greater than hcl Here one example is given here you can see if the ether in ether if one of the alkyl group is tertiary this is the this alkyl group is tertiary in this ether you can see one alkyl group is tertiary so if in uh, ether if one alkyl group is tertiary alkyl group then if this alkyl uh, this ether reacts with hi you will get a tertiary alkyl halide the alkyl alkyl halide produced uh, will be tertiary in nature and primary alcohol so just break this ether just break this ether from here and uh, add H, uh, iodine with this carbon and H with this carbon with o, uh, OH with oxygen okay and the ether will be converted into alkyl halide and alcohol now halogenation of reaction of ether this is a structure of anisole benzene containing OCH3 group is known as anisole so when and an, you have to remember anisole the OCH3 group Present in anisole is ortho para directing group. So, when anisole reacts with Br2 carbon disulfide, there will be, uh, there will be halogenation reaction and one Br will be enter into the ortho position with respect to OCH3 group in one compound. That means ortho bromo anisole and para bromo anisole will get because uh, OCH3 group is ortho para directing group. Similarly, on nitration, you will get ortho nitro anisole and para nitro anisole okay and use of anisole uh, with use of ether use of ether dimethyl ether is used as rep, uh, refrigerant and used as solvent at low temperature okay student thank you this chapter is completed alcohol, phenol and ether. 
read properly and follow the point which is given in the reduced syllabus okay 